no pictures, all right? I don't want to be seen here. <laughs> I want to bring on now a very talented guy, a guy who's worked for some of the most famous bistros in the country. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding around. I'm getting nuts now. It's getting late, you know what I mean? You know how it is when you're born in a truck. <laughs> Here we go. Our next performer is a very talented guy. A little weird, though. A little weird, I'll tell you that. I said to him, how should I introduce you? He said, who gives a shit? <laughs> He's my kind of guy. Okay, Bob Nelson, bring him on. Okay, Bobby, here we are now. All right, there you go. All right. There you go, baby. Yeah. <laughs> How you doing, babe? <laughs> What's this sign? I'm feces. <laughs> my, fr my friends call me number two. You know, you are the most beautiful woman I have ever seen in my entire life. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to say that. I don't know you that well. That was very forward of me. I'm very drunk. You can be very ugly, I can't tell. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I must be full. <laughs> Do you like football? Yeah! Good. Yeah. Okay, hold on a second. Let me show you this. This is great. Oh, first I want to show you my grandmother. <laughs> a lot of people get upset when they do that, but if you saw my grandmother, you'd say, that's her. <laughs> Here's my dream girl. Here's my dream girl lying down on her back. <laughs> Gotta take the good with the bad, I guess. Mm -hmm. Here she is standing on her head. <laughs> now, this is my football team. Too. And now, let's meet the players of the college all-star game. Billy Bob Brubeck, University of Texas, right guard. <laughs> Robert W. Wilson, Harvard University, quarterback. Hi, Muffy. <laughs> Number 72. Oh, shit, 27. Uh, Tony Cappuccino, Brooklyn University, and, oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Bruce Kuskiaski, San Francisco University, tight end. <laughs> uh, really, next year I hope to be a wide receiver. Hello. Football in my life. I love football. You can be playing football on the football field with a football. But when I play football, I'll make sure that I always wear protective gear, such as my helmets and them shoulder my pads. Don't ever go on the field without these things on, because you could get seriously killed. I myself, when I was a little children, I was playing football with my friends, and my head was accidentally ripped from my body. No, and, and my head was laying in the mud. And my body would run around tackling shit like this. <laughs> Finally, one of my friends put my head back on my body. And the doctor said that I had Dane Bramage. <laughs> but my friends don't know what the fuck that shit is. <laughs> anyway, the most important piece of equipment is called the cup. Now, it ain't no Dixie cup, and it ain't no coffee mug. And you certainly won't want to be drinking nothing out of it. 
It's a piece of cuff to wear because right there, and then you can't get hurt. Look. There ain't no way you can get hurt when you're wearing your cuff. Now, I ain't got my cuff on. <laughs> I can't see shit right now. <laughs> and my testicles are caught in my shoulder, my pants. <laughs> but I am not here to talk to you about my testicles. I am here to talk to you about the United Way. The United Way is the best candy bar you can buy. Oh, uh, Milky Way, Milky Way. The United, no. The, you, you can fly anywhere in the United States for $175 on the Ryan trip. No, that's the no, United Kingdom. Oh, uh, neutral Omaha. <laughs> Kingdom will fly you to the Milky Way for hair price. You see, I, I don't really know what the, what, what the United Way is. Uh, this producer said, do the commercial real quick. I said, I don't know what it is. So, uh, so it's, but I do know what UNICEF is. UNICEF is the Halloween disease with the milk and dinner car and kids come around trick trip for UNICEF. Now, no, seriously, you, you people probably don't know. No, listen to me, man. You people probably don't know what a human self is. I do. I've seen them. They, a human, it looks like a human corn. But ain't no human corn. It's a human self. It's a man with a Willie Johnson sticking up top of his head like that. I'm serious, man. This is where the term dick face and piss head comes from. These human all over the world. And they need your money. They need your money desperately to buy hats. To give to human self. Or you could give to the United Negro College Fund. I give to the United Negro College Fund because the mind is a terrible thing. And it must be stopped in our lifetime before I kill somebody. You know, I've been playing football all my life. If I did not play football, I would not be playing football today. This has been an announcement from the MFL. The mother... No, the NFL. The National Football League. Thank you very much. Nelson, huh? Hi, I'm Bob Nelson. Welcome to my HBO special. This is great. HBO wanted a unique opening, so this is what I came up with. Totally spontaneous. The camera crew doesn't know this, but this is Rodney Dangerfield's apartment. And Rodney doesn't know it, but he's going to open my HBO special. Bob, <laughs> what? Bob. what? This is Rodney Dangerfield's apartment? Yeah. It's kind of early, isn't it? I don't mean, worry about it. Don't worry. Take, get the shot right here. We're, we're, we're best friends, man. It's going to be great. This is going to be wonderful. Watch this. You ready? Yeah. Rodney! It's going to be great. Rodney! Rodney, come on. I know you're in there. God loves me. You? Rodney, this is my HBO special. Can you say something to open the show for me? You! We can use that, right? From San Francisco's fabulous Fillmore, HBO presents One Night Stand, starring Bob Nelson. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good night. <laughs> that kind of applause you get at the end of a the show. Uh, they're doing their job here, warming you up, huh? Well, uh, I really want to make you laugh, okay? But uh, this is uh, my first HBO special. I'm a little tentative, a little nervous, you know? And uh, a little tight. And ow! Yeah, and, you don't understand. It's just that I. Uh, I think it's a label in the back of my shirt, you know. I was, I was back there, I was going, can you just take it out? It'll ruin the material. I'm like, come on, just cut it out, you know. And the guy Franz back there is going, I'm not cutting it, it'll ruin your shirt. So I'm just gonna rip this out because it's really ridiculous. I can't work with it like this, it's just... Oh, oh my God. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. Uh, sorry. 
I'm not that nervous though, because I am from New York and I know how to, I know how to do this. From New York and uh, yeah, so I'll tell you, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready for this. We're gonna have a good time, I'm ready. I just wanna let you know there's no heckling during my set. They say I'm a little harsh and I don't want the show to get ugly or anything, okay? Okay, here we go. <laughs> okay, I think we understand each other now. Uh, I don't think there'll be any trouble. <laughs> Never is, unfortunately. <laughs> this is this looks real, doesn't it? Does this look real? Does this look real, yeah? Oh, gee. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just I get a kick out of that. I know it's a sick thing, but I just like to see the whole audience go. Oh. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. That's something I, I won't do down in Florida. There's too many old folks down there. Do that down in Florida. It's like boom, and then. Uh, pacemakers start going off these alarms <laughs> and the wives are looking through their purse I don't have your nitro honey I I don't know what happened <laughs> well uh, I'm no stranger to, to HBO I, I did a couple of specials with my friend Rodney and uh, yeah, I like to I'd like to uh, I'd like to start with uh, my opening there it is thank you I wrote that I wrote that the rest is written by writers but I wrote that. This is a little football thing I do. All right. Yeah, it looks like you know this. This is, uh, this is, okay, all right. <laughs> for those of you who have, 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 have never seen this before, it's pretty funny, it's a football thing, and uh, for those of you who have seen it before, same shit. <laughs> Let me show you someone first. Uh, here she is, my grandmother! I know a lot of people, a lot of people get upset. A lot of people get upset when I do that, but uh, I'll tell you something, not as upset as my grandmother gets. <laughs> I did this in front of her. She didn't get upset at all. I did this in front of grandma. She was sitting in the audience. I'm on stage going, grandma! Ay, 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 ay. You know? I blocked the lights to see what she's doing. She's standing on her table going, hey, that's me! <laughs> it's me! I was like, grandma, sit down, you're embarrassing me. <laughs> okay. This is for that uh, football piece that you know that. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I can explain that. Uh, that happens. Uh, that's a football player on a very cold day right there. It's cold out here, Coach. God. Where's my Parker? Uh, uh. Let me fix that because that's embarrassing. <laughs> I know it's a balloon, but there's a guy over here going, hey, buddy, come here. Let me have that. No. What is that thing? And now, let's meet the players of the college all-star game. <laughs> Billy Bob Rubick, University of Texas, <laughs> right guard. <laughs> Tom. Robert W. Wilson, Harvard University, quarterback. Hi, Muffy. Uh, yeah. Number 72. Oh, shit, no, 27. This ain't my jersey, this is a new jersey. Cappuccino, uh, Brooklyn University. And I, uh, for crying out loud, this thing busted again. This keeps busting. This sucks. 
I'm not playing. <laughs> Pepe Luepi, I kicked the ball. Bruce Kuskiaski, San Francisco University. Tight end. Next year, I hope to be a wide receiver. Right, uh, was the white shoes motto? Notre Dame. Half back. <laughs> Thank you very much. Good day. Thank you. Yeah, that's a lot of fun. I enjoy doing that. I just. Sometimes people think that hurts my hearing when I pop the balloon so close to my head. Hello? Hello? The microphone went off. Hello? <laughs> oh, that's so stupid. <laughs> All right. Oh, man, I'm glad you like that. <laughs> that's always a lot of fun to do. I, uh... I'd like to share this with you. Uh, not many people know this, but I'm in the I'm in the Guinness Book of World Records for a few things, uh, for two things exactly. Uh, two. I'm in there for uh, one. One. The first thing I was in the Guinness Book of World Records for is something I was born with, and I'm not at liberty to show you that. <laughs> no, there's really no point. Uh, you won't see it. <laughs> uh, I'd <bad> laugh. <laughs> I don't think that's funny, but if you want to laugh, fine. <laughs> I think that every comedian's an idiot, you know? And you're gonna make fun of us all the time. I'm just gonna pick up these balloon pieces. <laughs> that looks stupid. <laughs> now, I was talking about the Guinness Book of World... Oh, God. <laughs> I was talking about the Guinness Book. I'm in there for something that I think you're gonna be... Watch this. I am the fastest in the world at balloon folding, <laughs> sculpturing balloon animals. Thank you. Watch this. Okay. <laughs> no, no, don't get excited until you see this. Now, if you've ever seen anyone make a balloon animal, this gets the balloon ready. I do it because it gets me excited. <laughs> no, no, no. No, no, I'm only kidding. I'm only kidding. That's a joke. It does not get the balloon ready. I don't know why I say that. Okay. Time me on this. It's amazing how fast I am. Watch. An egg! All right, hey, thank you. An egg! Whoa! An egg! An egg that would kill a chicken! Whoa! It's too big! Whoa! Oh, God! Oh, God. Sorry about that. I don't know what that was. Uh, <laughs> it's, my, it's my dad's suitcase. I didn't check all the pockets. Uh, he said he's sick. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Man. Okay, here we go. She's gonna blow! No, no, no. I'm sorry, that was disgusting. That was uncalled for, I apologize. That's not my act. Uh, that's my grandmother's act, and I really shouldn't be doing her material because it's really not right. <laughs> did you ever do this when you were a kid? I did a lot, a little too much, look. I don't think that's funny either, but... Uh... I want to laugh. I guess. This is really neat, man. I love doing this uh, for my son. He, uh, he really loves this. Uh, static electricity. Electromagnetic activity. The balloon will stick to the microphone. Watch this, man. It's great. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't 
Uh, oh, no. Doesn't want to work. Oh, my hair's wet. My hair's wet. This works. This works. No, I'm serious. This works. It really does work. Oh, it's working. It's working. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Uh, no, no, no. The, bal the balloon usually sticks right to the mic. I, I, oh, that does feel good. That feels pretty good. <laughs> ah, a couple of dog lovers out there. I don't know what to tell you. It usually works, but tonight it's not working for some reason. I. I gotta put this jacket back on. I'd like to do a little, uh, something a little different here. You're gonna really, I think you'll like this. Uh, you know what pantomime is, right, pantomime? Let me tell you the story of the, of the pantomime so you know, because I'm not that good. Uh, <laughs> it's the story of a farmer who gets, uh, who gets uh, woken up in the early morning by all the animals on his farm, okay? And he gets really mad because this one duck keeps making a lot of noise, okay? It's pantomime piece now. Red Skelton does pantomime, I do pantomime, he does pantomime. This is my pantomime piece with sound effects, and I talk during it. So. <laughs> okay, here we go. This is, uh... <clears throat> okay. Uh, I'm the farmer now. I'm upstairs in my bedroom window in the farmhouse. The barn is off in the distance. The dew is on the grass. The sun is... Watch your step. The, the sun is rising. And you hear the sounds of morning on a farm, okay? Oh, I'm sorry, wrong planet. Wrong planet. <laughs> I'm sorry, I do so many shows a year and I just got screwed up there. Uh, all right, I got it now. Honey, it's snoring again. <laughs> Shut the hell up out there, will you? You animals make so much noise in the morning, right outside my window, and I'm sick of it. Oh, a wise guy, eh?
Wait a second, I'll get him. Yeah! <laughs> yourself now, a little duck. Well, you guess. I just said it. Oh, shit. Hey, don't get smart with me. Ow! I've got you in my hands now. I can do anything I want with you. Oh, my God. Yes, you better start praying, because now I'm gonna kill you. But I don't want to die. <laughs> Now, what'd you say, little duck? I said, I don't want to die. I told you, people. <laughs> you don't want to die, huh? No. Well, why not? Because I love you. Oh, you love me? Well, you know, you are kind of cute. Wow. Wow. You like that, don't you? Don't stop. Oh, no, no, I, I got to stop. See, I got in trouble with the sheep about a week back, I think. Right? <laughs> well, I think we'll let you go now. What are you going to do when I let you go? I'm going to poop on your face. You're going to what on my face? Oh, you're gonna poo poo on my face, huh? Okay, then, you little f duck. This is it. <laughs> I'm gonna eat you now. But I don't want to die. Don't start that again. It ain't gonna work. This is it. No, no, don't even do that. <laughs> any place, but I like Cleveland. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> hey, dude. I, Bob 
Close, I'm gonna let me close the show, okay? Cause, uh, okay, you ready? I would like to do my fam I'm famous for this impression. I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> I think it's excellent. Okay. Okay, you ready? This, this is an impression that Rich Little does not do, so... Okay. Oops, wait a minute. There's too many bubbles in here. Wait. I'm not there yet, wait. Okay, I'm a fish in a fish tank eating my food. <laughs> okay, I guess that was pretty weird. <laughs> that's, in my, that's my material, though. Okay, one more thing, and then you could go home. You could get these off any old lady's head in the street. <laughs> these are called babushkas. And I juggle these. It's called the juggling babushka bit. And I never dropped one, ever. I never did, right? <laughs> I just had to get this. <laughs> Something hit me in the head. I think, I think God got mad at me because I said I never dropped one. He finished me went like that. Okay. Okay, okay, here we go. Hope you like this. Wait a minute. Okay. I just have to dry my hands off. Okay. Okay, the juggling babushka bed. I hope you like this. This is pretty excellent. Okay, my throat. show and uh, I'll tell you I'm a little little nervous a little excited a uh, little uncomfortable I don't know why just a little oh, oh. <laughs> do you like boxing do you like boxing good I'm glad because uh, I'd like to do a little boxing character that I do here and uh, he's gonna come out and he's gonna talk to you a little bit about the boxing world he's gonna give you some pointers okay all right yeah. 
second to get this on. Probably take me uh, like half of, half of my set. <laughs> I was serious. It will take me like ten minutes. <laughs> oh, I have to go go now. <laughs> Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, Jiffy Jet. Training. Training, that's number one, okay? Okay, now, some guys take the train from their home into the city every day, which is also another type of training. Training on top of training. A lot of training going on. If you do take the train, get a monthly ticket, get a monthly ticket. I have a monthly ticket. I don't take the train, but it's such a bargain. I don't want anyone. Okay. So now you know where I'm coming from. Right back there. Okay, that's number one, training. Number two, number two. Two! Okay, I lost my train of thought. That's all right, though. I'll catch, I'll catch the next one. All right. Okay, number two. Right up there, number two. Number two ball. Number two ball. Out of the way. Combination shot. Two balls. Sorry. No, two. Number two. Training. Number one is training. Number two. Number two. Number two is a You need a nick. You need a nick. You need a nick. 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 Patty, whack. Give the dog a bone. No, you need a nick. nick. You need a nick. You need a nickname. You need a name. 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 Him. Five seconds. You have five seconds to name him. Do you know him? Do you know him? I don't know him. Uh, no. You need a nickname. Every great fighter has a good nickname. Like that. Who? Oh, oh, Jerry Cooney. Jerry Cooney is a very good fighter. They call him Gentleman. Gentleman Jerry Cooney. They call him Gentleman. 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 Start your engines. They call him Gentleman. Gentleman Jerry Cooney. And you know why? You know why they call him gentlemen? You know why? You know why? You know why? I have no idea why. But they do call him that, and it works. Here's another fighter. Marvelous Marvin Hagler. They call him Marvelous. You know why they call him Marvelous? Because he looks that good. So that's why they call him Marvelous. And uh, I, 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 J, K, L, M, N, O, P. I, I'm sorry. I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you something here. I have a nickname. 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 They call me, they call me, they call me Jeff. They call me Jeff, Jeff, Jeff. What? 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 I'm sorry, I thought I call him. Anyway, you probably, okay, now you probably look, you're probably looking at me saying, this guy knows nothing about the fight game. You probably look, you probably look, 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 look. Major look. You're probably looking at me. Look, look at me, look at me, look at me. Look at me. I, 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 I'm sorry. Okay, I, I've been in the fight game many years. I, I've had alto training, alto training, alto, alto. A lot. I spelt that wrong. A lot of training, a lot of training. I was a professional fighter at one time. I had, I had a couple of professional fights. I had what? I had how many fights? I, I had what? I had what? 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 Oh, I had six professional fights, of which I lost 11. But, uh... <laughs> I don't remember. I remember this, though. One time I'm in the ring with Hagler, Marvin, Hagler, Marvin, Hagler, Marvin, Hagler. One of those guys, what are you arguing about? It doesn't matter. Anyway, I remember I'm in the ring once, and uh, Hagler's hitting me, he's hitting me, he's hitting me, he's hitting me, and my knees buckle. I'm trying to get the buckle open. I don't know how my pants got down there. 
I can't get it open. Fuck him. He hits me again. I go right down, and my, my face slammed right into the canvas, which was very odd, because I landed on my back. <laughs> so come on down to my gym. Don't forget the four free pointers I've just given you. Number one, training. Number two, nickname. Number three, training. Uh, those four things are very important. If you have any questions, come on down to my gym, or you can call me at 555. 4343. Four, three. That number, once again, in case you missed it, 555-7299. And ask for Jiffy Jeff, 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 what, what, what?